What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to Wow. Holy crud. Never thought we could we would be able to do this or we would do this and all that crud too. Yes! Welcome to the very first episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Yeah, the hack game. And, uh, well, you could thank COVID-19 for all that stuff, too, because, uh, since a lot of you guys are have a lot of time on your hands, and so do I, uh, might as well come out with a hack walkthrough, that way I can entertain you guys a little bit further, aside from, you know, Pokemon Leaf Green and Black and all that crud. Uh, as you can see, Pokemon Liquid Crystal here, it is a Generation 3 hack game of Pokemon Crystal. It's just, you know, it, it's using the Pokemon Fire Red Leaf Green, uh, motor right here, and, uh, well... I heard a lot of great things about this game, uh, mainly because you can actually visit the Orange Islands, and I've always said, what would it be like to just play in the Orange Islands? So in this one right here, yeah, we're gonna get the chance to do so, so let's go ahead and continue on right here. Hello! Sorry to keep you waiting, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak, people call me the Pokemon Professor. This world, of course, with his whooper, is inhabited far wide by creatures called Pokemon. Some people play with Pokemon, some battle with them. But we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to solve. Returns at Pokemon, good. But first, tell me a little bit about yourself. Alrighty. You know, I am the champ of the world. You know, good old Draven, right? I am a boy. And uh, let's begin with the name right here. And good thing they have enough spaces for, you know, my name right here. So let's go ahead and uh, name ourselves Draven in all capital letters because that's what we're used to right here in Generation 3. And, uh, well, let's see. Right, so your name is Draven. Mm-hmm. The one and only. Draven, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story full of memories and tough challenges is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Oh, damn. So we're still waking up right here. Hmm. You woke me up. Will you check out the clock for me? What time is it? Don't know. What, 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 the clock stopped? That can't be right. Hmm. Well, it's kind of appropriate right now because, you know, thanks to COVID-19 right here, it feels like time stopped. That can't be right. Hmm. Try and read the clock again. It's too dark to see the clock at all. Perhaps I should play the game without the clock. It would suck, though. Should I? Yeah, might as well, right? Oh, well. Maybe later on I can see the clock again. I should remember, uh, though, timed events won't happen without the clock. That's a pity. Perhaps I, would, I should look into the clock problem more or try another emulator. Well, whatever the time is, I better get up. Okay, so here we are, guys. Generation 3's version of the Johto region, and I always said that, you know, Generation 3 was missing a lot of uh, Johto Pokemon. That's what I felt as a kid. And, uh, well, years later I found out that, yeah, you can actually play a hack game named Pokemon Liquid Crystal right here. Now, I've always, you know, I've always said that I've wanted to play a hack game, but I never got around to it. Uh, this has been going for 10 years, guys. 10 freaking years. Maybe even shorter because of, uh, you know, when I discovered hack games and all that stuff. But right here, I'm just going to be playing Pokemon Liquid Crystal. Just for your guys' entertainment. Uh, right now, tough times. Because we're all quarantined and all that stuff. And uh, I feel like, uh, you know, a lot of you guys have been watching my walkthroughs. Thank you very much. And I should be entertaining you guys in something else other than... The, you know, the regular walkers such as black and leaf green and all that stuff. So right here, we're going to be doing a little bit of a, you know, of a liquid crystal and all that stuff. And uh, I know what you guys are thinking. Are you going to bring back the old team from Crystal? Now, I thought about it, and I was like, ah, you know what? Since this is a hack game, I probably should deviate from that. You know, pick a whole new team. And maybe, maybe, just maybe, whenever I get the chance to actually play another game, such as, you know... That, that involve all these Pokemon, I could just bring him in and just say that, hey, look, my Pokemon are right here. I got a whole bunch of Pokemon. So here we are going downstairs, and Mama just looks at us, and she's like, oh, Draven, our neighbor, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he wanted uh, you to, uh, to do something for him. Oh, I almost forgot. Your Pokemon gear is back from the repair shop. Here you go. And there you go, guys. We got our Pokemon gear, which is always great, too. Uh, let's see. Key pockets. Oh, just a Poke gear. It's essential if you want to be a good trainer. To make calls, just turn the Poke Gear on and select the phone icon. Phone numbers are stored in memory, just choose a name you want to call. Gee, isn't that convenient? Yes, ma'am. Oh, I almost forgot, Draven. 
they were doing a discount on a new Pokegear expansion card. So I got it for you for your newly repaired Pokegear. Okay. You don't just have to pay me back or you don't have to pay me back, so enjoy it as much as you can. Now, one thing that I've always noticed in, in all games, Pokemon games, our moms are very thoughtful. And yes, yes, maybe we should give thanks to moms out there everywhere because you know they're the most giving one right the most giving people it ever so here we are guys in uh, new bark town wow like I'm, I'm like give me a second right here to just take this all in right here guys look at that uh never thought that i would be playing a uh, hack game before never and this is the first one one of maybe two i'm thinking about it right now i really am guys but Never thought that I would be playing a hack game, especially for the Johto region, and uh, you know what? Wherever this takes us, hopefully it's a good one right here. As you can see, it's the same thing. Here's a uh, Silver, or whatever his name is. So, this is the famous Elf pro Elm Pokemon Lab. What are you staring at? Bam, we got pushed out of the way. Yeah, I could, I, I could see that he's still a dick. Okay, alright, dick, let's move on right here. And we're going to be going straight to Professor Elm, and he just sees us right here. He's like, Draven, there you are. I needed to ask you a favor. I'm conducting a new Pokemon research right now, and I was wondering if you could help me with it, Draven. You see, I'm writing a paper that I want to present to a, at a conference, but there are some things I quite don't understand yet. So, I'd like you to raise a Pokemon that I recently caught. Thanks, Draven. You're a great help. When I announce my findings, I'm sure we'll delve or we'll delve a, a bit deeper into the many mysteries of Pokemon. You can count on it. And of course, he's gonna get himself an email, and he says, "Oh, I got an email." Hmm. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Hey, listen. I have an acquaintance called Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him saying that this is uh, this time it's real. It's an intri it, it is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Wait, I know. Draven, can you go? Uh, can you go in our place? Okay. I never even said yes, but okay. I want you to. I want you to raise one of the Pokemon contained in these balls. You'll be. You'll be that Pokemon's first partner, Draven. Go on, pick one. Okay. All right. Uh, you don't have to ask me twice. Now, like I said earlier, guys, uh, will I be bringing in the old Crystal Team? You know, from my Pokemon Crystal walkthrough. Bring back Cinder right here. Uh, well, no. Kind of want to do things differently. And since we are playing Pokemon Cri uh, Liquid Crystal, a hack game, I kind of figured that maybe I should just pick a team that, you know, I feel like I want to use, or that I've used in the, in the past. And hopefully, uh, this game right here delivers the Pokemon that I need and all that crud. Uh, if you guys remember too, in the old in the old uh, Crystal version, back when I was Draven XC711, I came out with a Chikorita. So there is one Pokemon that I had, I've had my eye on for quite some time. Yes, guys, Totodile is the next Pokemon that I will be using right here in this hack walk right here. So there it is, guys. We get ourselves our first Pokemon, Totodile, the water type Pokemon. No, guys, there is no fixation between me and a water-type Pokemon. Although we have been picking quite a few water-type Pokemon out there. So, let's see, give your Pokemon a nickname. Yes, I want to give him a nickname. Now, I thought about this. Totodile is a crocodile Pokemon. What do I associate crocodiles with? Well, I associated with one guy back in my childhood that I've, uh... You know, great respect for, kind of sucked that he died while doing what he was doing, or doing what he loved. So, I'm going to be calling Totodel Irwin from now on. Oh wait, it's a female. Eh, well, whatever. That really, <laughs> really doesn't matter, so here we go, guys. We're going to name our Totodile Irwin right here. And, uh, holy crap, he's like, I'm watching you, Elm. Who the hell was that? Anyway, Mr. Pokemon lives a little bit beyond Cherry Grove. The next city over, it's almost a direct route there, eh, they're so you can you cannot miss it. If your Pokemon is hurt, you should heal it right here on the machine on my right. Feel free to use it anytime. You should uh, be okay, but just in case, I'll give you my phone number. Call me if anything comes up. Okay, so he, he, he literally cussed in this game. I, I We're not going to ignore that, right? Okay, so let's see. He did that. And, uh... Let's see. Uh, Pokemon rarities. Too bad that they're rare and not useful. Oh, okay, well, uh, okay, so we're 
done with that, and before we leave any... Well, yeah, before we leave, Draven, I want you to have these for your errand, and we get ourselves another potion, which is always good. Very, very good. There are only, uh, two of us, so we're always busy. Hmm. Okay, I'm not gonna ignore the fact that he just said hell. So this guy right here... Wow, okay, so... Uh... So this was the first episode. Um... You know what? I'm gonna continue on right here. Screw it. I'm still, uh, I'm still in a loss for words right here, guys. Uh, so here we are in Route 29, and look at that! It is raining. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. Okay. So I'm loving this. I'm loving this right here, and uh, the the soundtrack here sounds pretty, pretty awesome right now. So again, guys, this is a real time uh, kind of feeling right now. Let's see. Stop moving. I do believe that this is the first time we met. Please allow me to introduce myself. I am Tuscany of Snowflakes. By the way, of in or by by way of introduction, please accept this gift: a silk scarf. A silk scarf. Okay. Oh wow! Wouldn't you agree that this is the most adorable, strange, normal type Pokemon in certain new? Okay. So that is a that is a new one right there. And how's your Pokemon ready for battle? Keep out of the grass. Okay. Alrighty, so again, guys, this is a real-time expression and feelings of how, like, of everything right here because this is, uh, this right here is, uh, yeah, this is all new to me, especially since we're playing a hack game. And uh, well, the one thing they're missing right here is, uh, well, the sprite's moving, but here we are in a uh, rainy situation right now. So let's go right ahead and scratch the crap out of this Pidgey right here. Oh damn! Okay, here we go. It continues to rain. Huh. There we go. Scratch attack. Hmm. I already got my eye on the first Pokemon. But again, guys, it, wow. Uh, I can't, can't believe that it took me. It took me this long to actually play a hack game right now, and uh, uh, hopefully we we finish this whole thing and make it a good one. I guess I don't even know. So there we go. Defeat Pidgey. That's right. And uh, we got ourselves some good experience points. Erwin did a good job right there. And uh, actually, let me check if yeah, it is holding something. Figured it was holding something, it's an Oran Berry, so that's always good right there. And uh, let's see, Torrent, of course, just like Sigh of the Torrent. So we got ourselves a good Water-type Pokemon, and this should be a good place to actually train it. And uh, here we found ourselves another potion, just like always, guys. Just like good old times, and here we got another Pokemon attacking us right now, and uh, it's a Hoo-Hoo. That looks like a shiny Hoo-Hoo to me. If it was a shiny hoo hoo, I'd try and capture it, but we don't have any kind of Pokeballs right now. So, again, guys, uh, this right here, yeah, it's a brand new experience for me. And uh, here comes the rain. And here he comes eating that Oran Berry right now. So, he's in full health again. Not much in full health. Come on. Come on, Erwin. Do it for the bitches. Come on. Here we go with the scratch attack. Alrighty. Okay, okay, so there we go. Leveled up to level six right there, and uh, okay, alrighty, so making some good progress right there. I wonder if we can run here. I don't know, maybe. Let's see, talk to this guy. I wanted to take a break, so I saved my progress. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, so I'm gonna save that for later because I think we already know what's going on up there. And uh, let's see, I see they brought back the. The trees that you can actually use a headbutt for. And uh, here's a Pokemon that we don't like to run into all, all the, like, quite a few times or anything like that. Let's go with the. Yeah, Erwin, come on, man. You gotta be a little bit faster than that. Ugh. Okay, so here we go. Watery. Okay, so it's raining still, and god dang it. Of course, Erwin has to be slow. So I have to level up, okay? Level up! There we go. Alrighty. Another uh, tackle attack right there. We're going to just be facing a lot of tackle attacks. And, uh, damn it. Yeah, where's a water gun when you need one? Really, where is that water gun? And, uh, yeah, this Raditya right here is just a little strong. So we're going to have to avoid Pokemon like the Plague right now. Oh, crud. Although we do have potions. And uh, it's a fruit bearing tree. Hey, there are two orange berries. Yes, I want to pick them up. Alrighty, so that's two to two orange berries. Okay, so okay, so they're just like a regular, yeah, they're they're like regular uh, trees, Pokemon trees, and you can actually plant them. 
What does this guy have to say? He's not saying anything. He's just standing there. Okay, what if I went like this? Nothing. So he's not saying anything. He's just moving around. That's uh, kind of odd for us right there. And, uh, well, let's see. There's another person right here. See those ledges? Scary jump off of them. New Bark Town, yada yada yada. Okay, so same old stuff. Whatever. Okay. Let's see. Um, Route 29, Cherry Grove Town. Okay, so here we are in Cherry Grove Town, and it's still raining. Holy crud. Talk to this guy. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everybody is a rookie at some point. If you like, I'd teach you a few things. Let's go ahead and talk to him. So, just like always, this guy will actually teach us about a Pokemon Center, all that stuff. And then the Pokemon. The Pokemon here looks a lot better than the other ones right here. You can buy some Pokeballs. And uh, here's the next route. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their prize Pokemon there. And, uh, well, this sea, as you can see, some po uh, Pokemon are found only in water. That is true. And uh, this guy right here is walking us straight to his house. Here. It's my house. Thanks for the company. Let me give you a small gift. And we got ourselves a map expansion card, which is always good, too. Okay. So he's going to walk in. And that is pretty much it right there for that guy. Pokemon Center. You put the map. Okay. So, yeah, we already did that. Now, let's go ahead and check out the Pokemon Center right here. Oh, damn. Look at that. Of course, there are no, no areas for trade. Okay. All righty. I see how it is. Let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon right now. And, uh, wow. Holy crud. Holy freaking crud. Now, again, guys, this is like a whole new experience for me. It's kind of like going into a new region right now because, uh, you know, this is a hack game and all that stuff. And, uh, let's see what this game has to, has to sell for me right here. Let's see. Well, we can only buy potions for right now. And, uh, I see that it's actually giving us a, uh, the option to go get, uh, escape ropes right here. But, uh, since I know the game, kinda, let's go ahead and buy ourselves some uh, antidotes as well. That way, you know, we, we don't get uh, hurt or poisoned by any of these Pokemon right here. So, that right there is good. And, uh, well, let us move out. Oh, damn, it's stormy. Damn. Okay, so does it clear right here? It almost does. No, it doesn't. It's still raining! Holy crud! It is raining over here. Okay, so let's see. There. Oh wait, no, no, the sun is cleared. All right, let's see what this house has to say. I'm pretty sure he's gonna give us something, right? Let's see. You know Pokemon that eat berries. Well, my Pokemon get a lot healthier by eating a berry. Here, I'll share one with you. And there it is. We got ourselves another Norenberry. Okay. Alrighty. Norenberry. So, damn. Holy shit, man. This is like. They are going off the book right here, and uh, let's see, we're gonna grab this, and we found ourselves an antidote, always nice, and uh, let's see, I'm pretty sure we can't battle any Pokemon trainers right now, because they're battling themselves, yes, they are blocking the way, those eight holes, them, so let's see, we're gonna be moving on right here, and uh, hopefully we don't run into any other Pokemon, maybe, we're gonna, there's a chance that we are, look at that, we ran into a Pokemon, and uh, well, there's a Pidgey right there. And, uh, well, I'm gonna get out of here because I don't wanna, I don't wanna get attacked right now, so... We just gotta get going and doing our thing right here, so let's see, there's some berries that we can actually grab. Let's see, the berry trees, there's two P.E.K.K.A. berries, let's go ahead and grab those. And, uh, let's grab these ones, two P.E.K.K.A. berries. Alrighty, okay. So we're doing our thing, and, uh, let's see, this is Mr. Pokemon's house, okay, like we didn't know. Okay, so let's see. Mr. Pokemon sees us. Hello, hello, you must be Draven. Professor Elm said that you would have visit. This is what I want Professor to, uh, Professor Elm to examine. We got ourselves a mystery egg. What a what a what a what a surprise. I know a couple who run the Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm. For Pokemon Evolution, Professor Elm is uh, the authority. Even Professor Oak here recognizes that. Oh, would you look at that? If my assumption is correct, Professor Ohm, we'll know it. Aha, so you're Draven. I'm Oak, a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Poke Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand uh, for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for, uh, for this errand. To researchers like Professor Elm I and I, Pokemon are our friends. 
He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Uh, it would seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data a on a Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech ex ex encyclopedia. And, uh, well, there you go. We got ourselves an uh, the high-tech encyclopedia. Go meet many Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've say I stay too long. I have a I have to get a gold or I have to get the golden rod for my po my usual radio show. Driven, I'm counting on you. Okay, you're returning, Professor Allen. Here, or yeah, here your Pokemon should have some rest, and uh, I think we already did that, so no problem right there. And uh, I'm depending on you. Okay, I believe we're gonna get a call right now, right? Nope, we got a call right now. Hello, Draven? It's a disaster! Um, it's just terrible! What should I do? Uh, oh no! Please, get back here now! Click. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this first episode of Pokemon Liquid Crystal. I mean, if it sounds like uh, I'm a little out of, you know, like... Just like out of thoughts or, you know, words or anything. It's because this whole place right here is new to me. Like, the, the hack Pokemon game realm right here. So... Stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we'll be continuing our adventure right here. You know, our hack game adventures. So, I'll see you guys later.